It's me again with my Red Bull. Yes, I look the exact same as I did in my other Sherlock video. It's been two minutes, I'm watching the next one. I watched the Many Happy Returns seven minutes weird thing that I kind of feel like was irrelevant. Maybe I'll feel differently after I watch the first episode of season three. I don't know if my body's finally crashing from the amount of Red Bull that I have, but my chest hurts. <laughs> Okay, I had a whole thing with my editing software, not my editing software, my um, screen recording software, so I just hope this works. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Who took the body? <laughs> oh, shut up! Shut the fuck up! The faith he has in that fucking rope. Mate. Oh, bless Molly. Oh, that's so fucking cool! two fucking minutes in fuck off no i actually need a minute okay fuck fuck my dog is looking at me like i'm a fucking idiot i'm shouting i'm actually shouting okay i knew he we knew he wasn't dead obviously we saw that at the end of the episode plus season two i know everybody was saying to me in the comments because they were fuming that i was being like obviously he's not dead obviously he's not dead because it's season two of a four season show and they were like oh. it sucks to be you i'm watching it later so <laughs> it was still traumatic and like i said I don't know if I said it in the video or if I said it to a friend because I've been talking about this to fucking everyone. But I was like, it's still, even though I knew he wasn't gonna die, it was still, I knew he jumped. We saw him jump. So obviously something happened, there was a switch. I understand that also he got knocked, John got knocked off um, his feet by the bike. Clearly that's because we, he, we needed him to miss something. I can't believe he just fucking snogged Molly. I kind of see I'm happy because at least she finally got the kiss she always wanted, but also like, you're just leading her on at this point. But also the cool music with the fucking, they, they shoved Moriarty off the fucking, off the fucking roof. Like, ah, it was so good. The two minutes, I just, I love this show so much. I love this show so much. Let's go, let's fucking go. I mean, is there a reason why he couldn't tell John that? No, 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 it's obvious. That's how he did it. It's obvious. Is that not what happened? <laughs> or is he right? And we just saw it. And that was just the, a really cool way of him. Oh my God, he stopped pausing it. I'm just, ah! A bungee rope, a mask, Darren Brown. Two years and the theories keep getting more stupid. They never all guilt. That's all this is. You pushed us all into thinking that Sherlock was a fraud, you and Donovan. You did this and it killed him and he's staying dead. Fair. And may God rest his soul. Anderson looks rough. Why is everyone growing beards and moustaches? Has he got another bitch? I swear to fuck. Ooh. There's an underground terrorist network active in London and a massive attack is imminent. Sorry, but the holiday is over. Brother dear. It fucking was. Back to Baker Street. It was Sherlock. Oh my God, he looks so different. What the fuck? Oh my God. Mate, I can't, like, it makes me so sad that this show only has this season and then one more. It's not okay. Please shave the moustache. I'm loving the little background music in this episode. Hey, Mycroft. Oh, he's still lizard. I would have thought he would have moved. Moriarty's network took me two years to dismantle it. And you're confident you have? The Serbian side was the last piece of the puzzle. Field work is not my natural milieu. <laughs> Braiding in. You sat there and watched me being beaten to a pulp. I got you out. No, I got me out. Why didn't you intervene sooner? I couldn't risk giving myself away, could I? I would have ruined everything. You were enjoying it. Nonsense. Definitely. He definitely enjoyed it a little bit. You forget lots of little things, it seems. Uh-huh. Not sure about that. Hmm? Ages you. 
It does. Trying it out. Well, it ages you. <laughs> Mrs. Hudson, why so sassy? I've no right to expect no. it. But just one phone call, John. Just one phone call would have done. I know. Aww. I need you to give this matter your full attention, Sherlock. Is that quite clear? What do you think of this shirt? Sherlock. I like it. One of our men died getting this information. All the chatter, all the traffic concurs. There's going to be a terror strike on London. A big one. We haven't been in touch at all to prepare him. No. We'll have to get rid of that. <laughs> we. He looks ancient. I can be wandering around with an old man. It's gonna go one one of two ways when he sees him. He's gonna either like just be like, oh my god, or he's gonna punch him. I've met someone. Surprise, oh. surprise. Oh, lovely. Yeah, we're getting married. Well, huh? I'll ask anyway. So soon enough to Sherlock. <laughs> they weren't What's together. His name? It's a woman. A woman? Yes, of course it's a woman. <laughs> Sherlock was not my boyfriend. Live and let live. <laughs> That's my motto. Listen to me. I am not gay. <laughs> it's been two years. He's got on with his life. Two years, man. What life? Quite in the way. I think maybe I'll just drop by. No. You know, it is just possible that he won't be welcome. Right. There isn't. You've been dead, quote unquote dead, for two years, trying to find out whatever was going on between the whole, like, Moriarty system, whatever. I understand that. I understand it was easier for you to pretend to be dead to do that because everyone thinks you're dead. No one's, like, looking for you. You're dead. I get that. But your best friend, even if you said to him, look, we can't be, we can't be in contact, but I need to go undercover, fake my death. Molly knew, he knew, but John can't know. If he walked in, I'd, oh, phew, fuming. And the fucking audacity, what life? I've been gone. Love it. <laughs> oh, he's so hot. What a sexy, sexy man. Oh, I can't wait for him to see him. Oh, he's so fair. Okay. Your wife just texted you possibly her contractions have started. Oh, he's back. No, 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 no. Why would you pause here? No fucking Wi-Fi. This happens all the time. I, I think I cut most of it out because I'm quite lucky it like, does it at like random times, but nothing like where it's really important because I'm watching on a dodgy site. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm so excited. <laughs> because I'm watching on a dodgy site, it fucking like buffers halfway through and it's fucking annoying. Oh my God. Can I help you with anything, Sarah? Hi, yeah, I'm looking for a bottle of champagne. A good one. Mm. I'll have that one, please. It is familiar, but uh, with the quality of surprise. <sighs> well, uh, surprise me. Certainly endeavouring to, sir. Is he actually going to stay with this one since he's proposing? Listen, um... I don't know, it hasn't been long. I mean, I know we haven't known each other for a long time. Go on. Yes, I will. As you know, these last couple of years haven't been easy for me. Any juicy face of an <gasps> old friend? Now look, seriously, could you just... Interesting thing, a tuxedo. It's distinction to friends and anonymity to waiters. Punch him. John? My defense was fair. He's gonna punch him. He's gonna hit him! Okay, it's not a great defense. Oh no, you. Oh yes. Oh my god. I'm not quite. Suddenly realizing I probably owe you some sort of an apology. I just. John, just keep. keep. Are you really gonna keep it's that? Punch him. <laughs> I don't blame him. Why? Because Moriarty had to be stopped. Oh. Why is it? I see. Oh, well, he would have needed a confidant. Mm -hmm. Sorry. But he was the only one? Molly. The only one who knew. So just your brother, Molly Hooper, and a hundred tramps. <gasps> no. 25 a month. Okay, I like Blondie. She seems to have a bit of banter, but bestie. Just leave. Like, this This really isn't your place right now. Like, she, she doesn't need to be there. Like, let him do his thing. Unless he's explicitly said, like, oh, I need you here for support. Just, just go. Seriously, it's not a joke. You're, you're really keeping this. Uh, uh, yeah, Mary likes it. Mm, no, she doesn't. She does. She doesn't. Oh, 
brilliant. No, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know how to tell you. Oh, why am I the only one who thinks that this is wrong? The only one reacting like a human being. Overreacting. Overreacting. John. Overreacting. So you fake your own death and you waltz in here large as bloody life. But I'm not supposed to have a problem with that, no, because Sherlock Holmes thinks it's a perfectly okay thing to do. It's the blood pumping through your veins, just the two of us against the rest of the world. I don't understand. I said I'm sorry. Isn't that what you're supposed to do? I like him. What? I like him. I think he's reacting perfectly normal. You would be fucking fuming. Mommy! <gasps> he's gonna tell a comic! Those things will kill you. Oh, you bastard. It's time to come back. Graham. Greg. <laughs> She's scared to think someone's breaking in. And she's got a fucking pan. <laughs> oh, bless her. What's going on? Please, would you do this for me? Please. Do what? This phone call. It's my note. Leave a note. <laughs> Leave a note when? Goodbye, John. No. <laughs> <laughs> It's fucking her from that E4 show. My Big Fat Diary? To be fair, I never watched it, but I always saw the clips of it. Fuck it, it's her. I haven't seen her or anything else. You're shaving it off. Well, you hate it. Sherlock hates it. Apparently everyone hates it. Ooh. Your move. We have solid information. An attack is coming. Solid information. Secret terrorist organizations planning an attack. That's what secret terrorist organizations do, isn't it? It's their version of golf. I've given the Prime Minister my personal assurance you're on the case. I'm on the case. We're both on the case. Look at us right now. Go oh, bugger. Oopsie. That's funny. I'm living in a world of goldfish. Yes, but I've been away for two years. So? Oh, I don't know. I thought perhaps you might have found yourself a goldfish. Change the subject. Client left this while I was out. What do you reckon? I'm busy. Oh, go on. It's been an age. Some women have short hair, too. Balance of probability. Not that you've ever spoken to a woman with short hair, or you know a woman. He's different, so what? Why would he mind? You're quite right. Why would anyone mind? <laughs> At Mrs. Reeves, Thrush. Right. You wanted to see me? Well, absolutely no one should have been able to empty that bank account other than myself and Helen. Why didn't you assume it was your wife? Because I've always had total faith in her. No, it's because you emptied it. Weight loss, hair dye, Botox affair. Lawyer, next! Stepfather posing as online boyfriend. What? Breaks it off, breaks her heart. She swears off relationships, stays at home. He still has her wage coming in. I run a little shop. Just on the corner of Charles Street uh, magazines. Not as good as your friend. It's not even a good disguise, Sherlock. Jack the Ripper. Mm -hmm. It's impossible. Welcome to my world. <laughs> so the whole thing was a fake? Yes. Looks so promising. Pass out. Why would someone go to all that trouble? Why indeed, John? <laughs> Poor Molly. My girlfriend's a big fan of yours. <laughs> Girlfriend? Sorry, do go on. I like trains. No. Yes. Thought you'd like it. He gets into the last car at Westminster, the only passenger. Oh. 
and the car is empty at St. James's Park Station. I know that face. I ordered um, a book from Vin from Vinted. I've been so excited to read it. It's Jeanette McCurdy's I'm Glad My Mum Died book. I'm so intrigued. Like I've seen her like read parts on TikTok and stuff, but I'm so excited to read it. And I'm not a big Zoe. I'm not a big reader, but I want to be. So I'm gonna try try and start with this. Sherlock. Mm. What was today about? Saying thank you. Moriarty slipped up, he made a mistake. It was the one person he thought didn't matter at all to me was the one person that mattered the most. And congratulations, by the way. He's not from work. Aww. He met three friends. She should not be engaged. She's not over him. Oh, Mrs. Hudson. So I, I think someone's got John. John Watson? Hang on. Who are you? I'm, I'm his fiance. <gasps> Mary? What's wrong? What are we waiting for? This. Sick. What does it mean? What are they gonna do to him? I don't know. Oh shit. Using things down the back of the sofa, aren't you, dear? Great right, so. Oh, keys, small change, sweeties. Well, yes, thank goodness we caught the coach on time after all. Uh, no, 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 they were just leaving. Oh, oh, were we? Yes. No, no, if you've got a case. No, no, not a case, no, no, no. Go, yeah, well, go. we're here till Saturday, yes, remember? Yes, great, wonderful, just yeah, get well, out. Just parents? Please, it's all over. Ring up more often, won't you? Mm -hmm. Just my parents. Your parents? In town for a few days. Your parents? Michael promised to take them to a matinee of Les Mis, trying to talk me into doing it. And why did they target me? I don't know. Is it someone trying to get to you through me? Is it something to do with this terrorist thing you talked about? I don't know. I can't see the pattern. It's too nebulous. If one of them starts acting suspiciously, we know something's up. Five of them are behaving perfectly normally, but the sixth... I know him, don't I? Lord Moran, peer of the realm, Minister for Overseas Development. It's not an underground network, John. It's an underground network. Right. Moran didn't disappear. The entire tube compartment did. The driver must have diverted the train and then detached the last carriage. Down there. Well, why is that on the maps? Because it was closed before it ever opened. What? They built the platforms, even the staircases. But it all got tied up in legal disputes, so they never built the station on the surface. Mm. Right. What are you doing? You're calling the police. What? No. Sherlock, this isn't a game. They need to evacuate Parliament. Get in the way. They always do. There's nothing. Isn't there? It's not carrying explosives. Damn. The whole compartment is the bomb. Oh. So what do we do? <laughs> I have no idea. We'll think of something. Why do you think I know what to do? And because you're Sherlock Holmes, you're as clever as it gets. Doesn't mean I know how to defuse a giant bomb. What about you? I wasn't in bomb disposal. I'm a bloody doctor. Oh, shit. So you can't switch the bomb off. You can't switch the bomb off, and you didn't call the police. Go, John. Go now. There's no point now, is there? Because there's not enough time to get away, and if we don't do this, other people will die. Use your mind, Palace. How will that help? You sorted away every fact under the sun. Oh, well, you think I've just got how to defuse a bomb tucked away in there somewhere? Yes! <laughs> Maybe. Definitely should. I can't do it, John. I don't know how. This is a trick. No. Another one of your bloody tricks. No. Hey, you're just trying to make me say something nice. <laughs> I wanted you not to be dead. Yeah, well, be careful what you wish for. If I hadn't come back, you wouldn't be standing there. You'd still have a future. Mycroft fed Moriarty information about me. Moriarty, in turn, 
gave us hints, just hints as to the extent of his web. I had to make him believe he'd beaten me, utterly defeated me, and then he'd show his hand. But the one thing I didn't anticipate was just how far Moriarty was prepared to go. I suppose that was obvious given our first meeting at the swimming pool. His death wish. And then everyone got to work. Now stay exactly where you are. Don't move. Yeah, honestly, Shut still up! fuck that. I needed to hit the airbag, which I did. Speed was paramount. Our well-timed cyclist put John briefly out of action, giving me time to switch places with the corpse oh. on the pavement. Squash ball under the armpit. Apply enough pressure, and it momentarily cuts momentarily. off Momentarily. Molly. Molly Hooper. She was in on it. Yes, you remember the little girl who was abducted by Moriarty? Get out! I assume she reacted like that because I was her kidnapper. But I deduced Moriarty must have found someone who looked very like me to plant suspicion. That meant there was a corpse in a morgue somewhere that looked just like me. No? No, I think you know why I'm here, Philip. How I did it by Jack the Ripper? Of course, you wasted police time. Converted to the course of justice. Risk distracting me from a massive terrorist assault that could have both destroyed Parliament and caused the death of hundreds of people. Oh, God. Anderson's fucking lost it. Is he doing it again? Why is he such a twat? That's not funny! You thought he was gonna blow up! You knew! You knew how to turn it off! There's an off switch. There's always an off switch. Uh, well, we've got May. Oh, spring wedding. Yeah. Well, once we've actually got engaged. Yeah. We were interrupted last time. Yeah. Well, I can't wait. You will be there, Sherlock. Weddings, not really my thing. Champagne? Yes. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Being a hero again. Don't be stupid. You'd have to be an idiot not to see it. You love it. Love what? Being Sherlock Holmes? Even know what that's supposed to mean. Fucking idiot. I have got an axe to fucking grind. Like 80% of you lot were telling me how shit season three is. That was such a good episode. I'm like, I loved it. I loved it so much. Oh my God. The Moriarty and fucking um, Sherlock scene where they nearly kissed was hilarious. Him kissing Molly and then walking off. Oh, sexy, sexy man. Molly's fiance is interesting. Oh my God. I cannot thank you enough for giving me so much shit that I needed to watch this show because I'm having the time of my life. <laughs> I don't want to rush through it because I want to enjoy it, but I'm also enjoying it so much that I can't just keep waiting. <laughs> Let me know what you thought about this episode in the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you when I see you. Adios.